it's 8 10 a.m. leaving New Albany for the big adventure heading down to Benton Kentucky to see the total eclipse of the Sun <laughs> well I'm on the road on I-65 I'm just now passing the Clermont uh, Barnstown exit in other words Bernheim Forest a few little delays on the way but not terribly uh, terribly bad the roads open wide open Something's going on up here. It's like a car overheated over there. Two miles to E-Town. Traffic is still creeping. All right, I'm on the uh, Western Kentucky Parkway. Finally got out of that mess on I-65. It's getting closer. God, it's been a long drive. Stopped at the Dairy Queen at a deli bar. So all is well, and it looks like the skies are holding up well, so hopefully this will happen. All right, <laughs> I'm really getting close now. Um... Hallelujah. Here I am at Big Bear Resort. I uh, just arrived and uh, just spoke to John Turak and Bob Cruz up there on that hill over there. And I see Ted Ernie. I'm going to look for other LAS people right now. Troy Gar, the original space Viking. Look, look at there. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. Miss Burba. Uh huh. Yeah, got her glasses ready. I understand there's going to be an eclipse today, but you know the sun. The clouds are doing a really good job. Oh yeah, they're they're getting worse and worse and worse, clouds. and it's kind of scaring me to be get, to be honest. Uh, well, I traveled a bit further than you did, so you bet you did. <laughs> well, uh, except for your friends from San Diego, I'm probably one of the furthest. Yeah, yeah, except right, you would be right. <laughs> Don't accuse me of bringing these cumulus clouds. They're scaring me <laughs> at this point. What do you think? Well, I'm looking at it over there. We're keeping our fingers crossed. You just don't know. Frank, you've got to do something about this. Well, I brought a Martian. What can I do? <laughs> yeah. can't, can't you fly your UFO over and kind of cool the ground to the west of the uh, so kind of knock out? I, I, I would contact them, but I don't have any cell phone service here. You too. Join the club. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah, weird feeling. I can't do it. Yeah, it's, oh, yeah. right. It is. Exciting. It's taken a bite out of it, hasn't it? Oh, big bite. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Well, I'm getting, beginning to get worried for two reasons. These cumulus clouds are thickening. And secondly, I don't know how to find the westerns. Wes, Aaron, where are you? There it is. Total. Total eclipse. Beautiful corona. The planet Venus is out here. It's just 
just incredible. Oh, they were wrong about that. Here comes the Bailey's bees out on the end. It's coming out again. Forget that. Ooh. Wow. Here comes the sun again. I can still see Venus. Uh huh. Yeah. Well. I was thinking, no, I, I couldn't see Venus. Now it's daytime. Well, but of course, <laughs> it's by the sun. Oh my God. Wow. A shaft of light going across. Ooh, can't look at it now. There was this beautiful orange yeah, glow the across the whole, yeah. well you saw it, yeah. above the lake. Yeah. Venus was, you still, yeah I can still see Venus. It's not bright enough yet, you can still see Venus over here. Oh yeah. I didn't notice any other stars or yeah, planets. Yeah, there was one other one right over here. Uh-huh. Yeah. See it right there? Uh, it's getting yeah. pretty damn there. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. I don't know what that one wow. is. Wow. <laughs> I'm about ready to pass out. Yeah. That was just amazing. Wow. God, how could two and a half minutes go so fast? Oh, blink oh. of an eye. You feel like you're never going to be the same after this somehow. Oh, yeah. I had my camera set up ready to shoot the Corona. Did I get it? No. Want <laughs> <laughs> to see my colander? Uh, tree leaves. Yeah, yeah tree leaves are great. It's going on all the time, but just because it's a big circle, you don't really... Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, it only projects like that. We've done that in San Diego with the pinholes. The are kind of... Yeah, you can do yeah, it. Just... <laughs> wow, look at Or any comment on the experience uh, with what you just went through? Uh, I preferred it when during the eclipse because it was much cooler. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, that, that, you, that was your biggest It was benefit. well worth the drive. Oh, boy. Look at that. Well worth the drive all the way from Arizona. Yes. What town in Arizona? Gold Canyon, mm. which is east of uh, Phoenix. Mm -hmm. I got oh, a, you got the diamond ring. I got, I got a couple of some really good diamond rings. And, Mm -hmm. These are all handheld with the 300 millimeter. Mm -hmm. So we'll, well see. You can blow Oops. them up as big as you want, yeah, right? Exactly. Yeah. Intentions. No, they <laughs> live long. Huh. Well, what do you think? Did it, it meet all great. your expectations? Oh, Was it more exciting more than open. finding the Ring Nebula? Oh yes, I, absolutely. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Uh -huh. and this even surpasses the Ring Nebula. Oh um, wow! Yeah. Boy, you must have really liked it then. Yeah, it was incredible. Mm -hmm. Experience of a lifetime. Yep. If you weren't here, you missed the show. Well, there's not a second chance unless you're around in Indiana in 2024. Yeah, 2024, next eclipse, Batesville, Indiana, my hometown. Well, you're all welcome to come. Yeah, yeah. okay. <laughs> here I am with Walton Gar. He was telling me that he's uh, had more or less uh, more success than and, not. <laughs> and uh, right, I've got, got the Corona, got the Diamond Ring, got Bailey Speeds, got Everything that goes with a total eclipse of the sun. That's right. The yeah, so yes, problem I'm is there's no second chances unless in 2024 you can try again. We'll see. If I'm 70-something, I'm better shape than I am now. I'll be in my 80s. Oh! Oh! Yes. Oh, I shouldn't have said that on the air. <laughs> now there's a record. Now, right. Now everybody knows. Uh -huh. Never mind. I was just kidding. Yeah, yeah. He was just being sympathetic. 2024, I'll be what? Maybe 38, 39, something like that. Something like that. With a few extra years of experience. Yeah, that always helps. Well, Frank, in conclusion, what do you think? Did it live up to everyone's expectations? And were you thrilled and happy? And are you. Go ahead, you say something. Yeah, we need to do this again. Make sure make sure we got it right. The set, the gate, make sure we got everything right. So, Yeah. Heads up behind you. Make sure we got everything right. We didn't get everything right this time? Filming. Hi.
Yeah. It was only, it was only two minutes. It went by too quick. So yeah. a little bit before we were able to see the the beads and the diamond ring through our projection devices here, and mm -hmm. um, got a couple people here who are on cloud nine because they got their Corona pictures, and definitely worth the experience. Absolutely. Everybody who missed out needs to pay attention in seven years. If I'm not dead, I'll be there. Yep. Same here. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Thank you.